Hey guys, John Luxy here, back with our blind playthrough of Terranigma. With me today is Manny, right there. He's a happy cat. Chilling out. Uh, right, so last time we... Ooh, that's a little loud. Last time we restored humans. Um, and had a dream, so potentially... Potentially a lot of time has passed. Um, so I guess we'll start by leaving this area and not talking to anybody. We're in, we are in Lhasa. Alright, we'll, we'll start. We'll start out front. Yep, nope. okay, we'll leave the, we'll leave the, um, Little snow snowmen. Uh, I had this weird thought in between recording this one and the last one, and it was, uh, are these supposed to be women? That's probably true because of the boobs. Um, and it was, uh, we're probably never going back to that crystal area at the beginning of the game. Like, L is because if, if all this time is passed, I mean, it's possible that the crystal area is like outside of time. You know? Um, who knows? But the, uh, it wouldn't make sense for these to be, like, representations of women. Uh, like, fertility goddesses, the fertility statues are always, like, um, short, fat, big boobs, because you want a, you know, wide hips for, for giving birth, right? And if they're, if they're fat, or at least, like, not fat, like, 600 pounds, like, fat today, but, like, thick, right? Chubby. Um, which is actually the ideal, right? If you, if you survey or look at preferences for, for people in general, or men, men in general, uh, because it's like a, it's a health thing, right? It's, it means they're well-fed, not, and, and, you know, we didn't evolve eating like fast food and stuff. So like the not the poison we're all eating today. It's it's if you were if you were you know if you were thick eating like you know game meats and uh, and stuff like that, then then you're doing all right. You're doing well for yourself, and that's a that's a woman to be desired. Talk to me, dude. Talk. We built our homes in stone cliffs to avoid harsh winds and snow. Oh, I mean, he's got his little foot back here. It's adorable. It's adorable. <laughs> All right, we have like a storeroom or something. Can I pick these up and... Actually, I wonder, have you already seen Lord Kumari? He was very concerned about you. Lord Kumari has a wonderful power. I have not already seen him. I would like to, though. Um, can I talk to the animals? Bah. I wonder if I've lost my ability to talk to animals. Right, now the humans are awake. You know? Yaks are important. It carries things. It gives milk and meat. And its dung can be burned as fuel. Nothing goes to waste. Right. Right? I mean, that's that's the thing. It's like you, when you're subsistence living, basically, right? Like, living hand to mouth. Um, yeah, whatever you can use. They would use animal dung to... Well, they'd mix it with, like, straw and mud, and it would be, like, mortar for bricks and houses and stuff. <laughs> you know, and, and these days we'd be like, we're like, ew, but, I mean, that's... That was how you did it back in the day. You didn't have like steel frame construction and stuff and wood was scarce a lot of the time. You feel fine already? You were in deep sleep for three years. Whoa. Don't exert yourself. Eat well and build your strength. Yeah, that the deep sleep for three years and stuff, it's like that's I I, I call I'm called Lukey. I'm glad you're better. Ark, was it? I was shocked when I found you. You were curled up like a newborn baby in unshakable sleep. 
Luki. Whoa, we get a second thing of dialogue. I don't know if we've had that at all this game before. Luki took care of you while you slept on. She took care of you in a way that even that impressed that impressed even us. Do you want some butter tea? It's nourishing and tasty. Sure. Okay, so now we have to start talking to people twice. You feel fine already. Don't exert yourself. Okay. Yeah, and also something to be aware of is these people in, like, olden times did not take care of outsiders, right? And in fact, it, you know, if you're wondering about, like, the, the origins of racism and stuff, it's natural and even good, right? Because outsider, like, you're... Every tribe that's not yours, all every stranger... I mean, they're all trying to survive as well. So if they have to kill you and steal your stuff to survive, they will. You know, it's like it's like animals in nature. That's how humans used to live and still do. Right. That's the thing. Call me an asshole if you want. Right. But it's it's important to remember that we still are those people. From, you know, a hundred years ago, a thousand years ago, whatever. We are still the same. Right? And when all else fails, if civilization breaks down, those are the instincts that will save us and keep us alive. You know, so it's it's nice. It's nice to be all, oh, you know, I'm colorblind and all that stuff. And and to an extent, sure. It I mean it's it's good, right? Um, while we can be civilized, but it's Everyone, everyone could potentially be a threat. So it's something to be aware of, you know? But yeah, in the olden days, um, they'd, they'd kill outsiders. The fact they saved him, you know? It's like, oh, you're, you're a scout for an enemy tribe? Like, who are you? What are you? Right? They don't just take people in and, and raise them. It's like, what, what do you have? What's your stuff? You know? Do you, you know, you're collapsed, you're not waking up, do you have some sort of disease? You know, you know what I mean? Like, what's, what's the deal? When I grow up, I'm becoming a monk to protect Lord Kumari. So yeah, it's a little... Oh, it's you, you're finally awake. Pleasant dreams. I can't talk to animals or... I don't know if I could talk to plants anymore, but I guess we'll see. Just saw Jack run by. This is probably Lord Kumari. Lord Kumari started this. You belong to nothing, and therefore you are important. What? Stated this. You belong to nothing, and therefore you are important. Oh, is he aware? Lord Kumari is a living god. He will be reborn after his death. Oh, there goes Manny. What's up? What's up, my cat? You want to get in my lap? You don't have to. Oh, you're going elsewhere? You're gonna go eat? Alright, that's cool. Yeah, so he's like, I mean, we already saw the Buddhist statue. Statues. Buddhist statues, right? There's Jack. Through many bodies, he has witnessed the world's growth. Oh, interesting. I wonder if it's true or if it's a scam. You finally awoken, Ark. I'm Kumari. Until you get better, you should rest at Lhasa. It is safe here. You will discover what you must do in due time. You can no longer converse with plants and animals. Oh, dude, he knows. He does know. Okay. Take this with you. In dire danger, use it to summon me. Ark obtained bone pin. Oh! But we could still do magic. Interesting. Oh, we got someone coming in. Whoa. 
Here comes Jack, maybe. Switch to scotch. I'm hoping it'll do better. I really think it was the salmon that was upsetting my stomach earlier, but... Oh well. Lord Kumari, Master Mayhow, Mayho? Mayhu? Has arrived. Yes, I know. Please tell him to come. Check. Bubba. <clears throat> okay. Ark. There is always a purpose to what occurs in life. Your presence will inevitably be tied to whatever will happen here. Uh-oh. Is this Mayho guy gonna come and raise the village? You know? <sighs> it's like... <clears throat> I, I don't know. I just... All this stuff that's going on in the world today, all the wokeism, all the all the abolish the police desire, all that stuff, it's like that is just extreme naivete, right? Because these people have been coddled for their whole life and they think there's nothing bad that'll happen. But the world is a freaking awful place and people are terrible. You know, and like I said, we haven't changed much. We are still, we are still the people in the past. It's just now we smile at each other while we stab each other in the back. You know, would you like to get in my lap, crazy one? Do you see this little cat face right here? Oh my gosh, she is so cute. Thank you for not stepping on the keyboard. I appreciate it, my little cat. I'm going to grab your belly a little bit. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. Come on. Yes, I know. Come. Into the lap. I feel so bad earlier, or yesterday, I he did this and I picked him up and then he was kind of wiggling, so I went to set him down. And the table's right here. And so as I set him down, he was wiggling and I just heard a bunk like a heart. Oops, sorry, I didn't mean to scare you. Where the top of his head just whacked the edge of the table and I was like, oh! Poor baby. Poor baby. I'm not gonna pick you up again. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna whack your face into the edge of the table again, my kitten. I am not. Listen. Listen, you. Why you do this? Why? All right, well, let's go. All right. Oh, Jack. Let's still talk to everybody. It's interesting. He's he's like, he's like, hey, you know, you you can no longer talk to plants and animals, which is fair, right? Oh, okay. I see. Oh, Jack, you are. Yep. Don't go for the scotch. You won't like it. Yes, I see you. I see you, kitten. I just... Now I can't see either screen, really. Alright, uh... Mr. Mayho has been to many places and tells us neat stories. Would you, uh, like to move, or are you gonna barf on my phone right there? Uh, okay. Okay. Good kitty. Where are you going? Meho studied under the previous Lord Kumari in the past. Oh, he has been away on long journeys. It is rare to find him in Lhasa. All right, well, let's go in here. I think we've missed... I know we've missed some people. All right, save point. We slept a long time in darkness and re-emerged in this world. What has happened came about because of something in the past. Interesting. So they're aware. I assume because they're enlightened that they are aware, but probably to everybody else, they're like, what do you mean? It's always been like this. Everything now is rooted in events from previous lives. I, you know, honestly, I like the... I don't know if it's Buddhism or... Or is this Hinduism? Um, But I like the whole idea of re reincarnating yourself, 
right? Like you do, you do better and you keep reincarnating. And depending on how you do in your previous lives, either like, you know, you get promoted or demoted, basically. Like if you're a good person, next life is a little bit better. <clears throat> All living things eventually lose their physical forms. We live praying for our happiness in our future lives. Works for me. I don't believe in any future life, though. I think this is the only one we've got. All that people do and have done will shape the future. The past shapes the present, and the present shapes the future. Indeed. Oh, let's check out the... Oh, sorry, that's the wrong button. And, yeah, we need to purchase more medium bulbs. I want to look at this pin. All right. Uh, grass pin, bone pin. A teleportation spell from Kumari. Hmm. Spell that cures all abnormalities. Oh, I see. So that would be like how you cure curse and other stuff. Probably. Or not curse, uh, confusion. This heals. Yeah, and you can never go back. That was... I just had this weird mental image of, like, like right here. It kind of looks like hands coming in from the side. You know, like the fingers? Like your... I don't, I don't know. And that reminded me of this anime called Ra Zephon, which is really interesting, honestly. Um, which, I mean, if you haven't seen it, I guess watch it. It's, it's kind of like Evangelion with like giant robots and stuff, but it's also, I, I don't, I remember like the imagery, like the floating ships from, from Moo. You know? Oh, I wonder if we're going to see spirits around. Welcome, what can I help you with? Okay, get some bulbs. Monk robe? Yes. To be honest though, that looks more like armor. I mean, it is armor, but it doesn't look like a robe. They probably chose robe. Because translation. They only had eight characters, you know, something like that. All right, this one. Monk robe. Deflects curses worn by monks. Hell yeah, so the ice suit is optional. You're equipped. We're running out of room here. Running out of room. Well, I guess that's why you can take the stuff and drop it into the hole. Um, yeah. Deflects curses. That's awesome. Alright, well, that's our shop. Can't talk to animals anymore. That actually makes me really sad. That'll be interesting for dungeons, then. Like, how do we... Like, so what? No more yetis in hot springs? Meho's grandchild wields a strange power. It's said she could freely create and control mirages. Huh. Meho traveled seeking the truth behind an old saying of Lhasa. What was the saying? He who throws snowmen... Something, something. I don't know. Is that where we went? Yeah, that's Kumari's room. And that just goes up. So, alright, let's... Well... Okay, um... Oh, is that the dude? Meho? Meho. Oh, they spelled it wrong. Kind of. Ah, back at last. Huh? An unfamiliar face. I must first speak with Lord Kamari. If you wish to speak with me, it will have to wait a while. Let's follow him to Kamari. I don't think I need to specifically follow him. But I do want to go... Um... Interesting. Can I... Actually, that's the only way to get into this room. Why is this light right here? Well, whatever. 
Yeah, so presumably, uh, what's his name? Oh, interesting. Yeah, the other room's over there. Wait, so where does this go? Ah, oh, I see. Let's try... Can we sleep in this one? Yes, you can. All right, cool. So, yeah. Restore health. Yeah, so presumably Kamari found us, or, I mean, the person found you. And then, uh... And Kumari was like, oh, this, this kid's special. I mean, he knows who we are, kind of. Um, right, we're going to Kamari. Um, hmm. Did I screw this up? I mean, you know. <laughs> no, not that one. We can't sleep in that bed, can we? I must sleep in all the beds. Mhm. Mm hey, Hosai, it's I'm having a difficult time with my granddaughter. You mean Maylin? Even the wisest mind in Lhasa is no match then. I'm embarrassed. Lord Kumari, what can one do? Spending all her time in a mirage of a town cannot be good for her. Worse, her own power could cause trouble. I believe this young man will be able to help. You are Ark? I've heard about you from Lord Kumari. I was just talking about my granddaughter. She's named Maylin. She used to live in Loran with her parents, but the town fell in war. She lives with me now, but she misses her dead parents. So she spends her days playing in the ruins that were Loran. Where is Loran? In the desert northeast of here, supposedly. However, I could never find it because Melan obstructed me. I see, but she doesn't know us, so she won't stop us from going. Where is Loran? In the desert northeast of here. We'll find it. It's probably only one way. Ark, your presence here is not without purpose. The arrival of Meho after your awakening is also significant. Can you lend us your strength for Meho and Meilin's sake? Sure. Yes, indeed. We will do this. Okay, well now it's right. That's your that's your clue. You're supposed to go to the illusory city of Loran. So before we do that, Let's save. Especially because now we have better armor. Yeah, Jack. He is unfazed. Well. All right, here. That's probably, probably, a, no, that's where we were, right? We went there and that's where we passed out, I guess. Oh, ah, a little castle. Oh, and a bridge. Yangtze, so the northeast, so there. All right, well, let's try. You know, I'm sure we're, I'm sure we're probably still gonna be able to talk to spirits, right? That's what I would expect. What about this? Really? Was that supposed to happen? Come over and buy something. Oh, fur coat, yeah, yeah, yeah. Welcome to the magic shop. Right, they didn't have one. Okay, so... I don't know how many of each... I have a grass pin, wind pin... Oh, no bone pin, though. Let's see how many of each we have. Okay, so... Grass pin two, wind pin... Let's get at least one more. 
another pyro ring, if we can. Uh, eh, that'll work. You desire that? Yes. I don't know what the pyro rings do. We're gonna have to do them, though. I'm kind of amazed... Oh! Yeah, this is not supposed to be here. Right, I can't talk to him anymore. But this is still... Alright, so... Can I go back into... Well, there's my Manny. What is this area? Right. Is this a bug? Like... Okay, I know they can't talk to us. And they just... They just straight up don't... Interesting. So you... You can... Go back. Well, hello, my little cat. But all the animals that you used to be able to talk to can't talk to anymore. You just have lost the ability to speak with them. So the question is... Is it just like three years have passed? Or is it more than three? Wow, we're pretty close to another level. Like a 150. There goes Jack. That's fine. It'll come... The level will come with time. Am I gonna get eaten by the lions here? This is the question. Huh? Oh, really? All right. So what, can I go to Japan? What are you, or where are you gonna try and jump to? What are you, what are you doing? What do you see? Do you see something? Crazy kitties. Crazy, crazy kitties. Okay. King Ness. So can I talk to the bird? Brother, you can. Alright, so it's... Um, that's Wind Farm, right? Or Wind Vale or something? Is this the one that's gonna take me back to Okay, well this is the this is the middle. Let's try the left one. Cause we we were at the middle one when this area reloaded, so I'm pretty sure that I don't know, I don't remember if the middle one goes to Africa or not. I'm probably screwed. I'm probably choosing the wrong one here. So we chose the left. We have about a 50-50 shot. Because I know the right one takes us to Windvale, right? Uh, oh, we're turning that way. Ah, oh, crap. Well. <laughs> Should have stuck with my gut, I suppose. That's fine. Do I ever 
Do I ever not get a spear? Do I get like a gun or something? But I can still talk to spirits. Zap, Geo, Snow. Um. Let's get three. I mean, we don't... I'm not using them at this point, but, you know, nothing wrong with it. Nothing wrong with getting more. And... Oh, well, hello there. Do I just take this? Let's talk to the dude first. You want to play? Uh, no. Come again. Can I just take it? No, you don't. I found it first. Okay, we're, let's play then. Sure. Just whack as many monsters as possible in 30 seconds. But you lose points if you hit a yellow monster. On the chime, go. You don't hit the yellow... Oh, well. Oh, okay, well. How many do I need? Congratulations, you scored over 30 beasts, so we'll give you a prize. You have just won a beautiful stone I found here. Congratulations. Hell yeah. You want to play? Uh, no. Come again. So there was a purpose to that room. I'm glad I came back here. I was like, there's no way... You know? All right, well... Am I going to be able to talk to any of them? I mean, I'm sure. I'm sure the answer is no. Also, what is this guy, the game show guy, what is he doing in a lion's den? I just found this rock. I'll give it to you for whatever, you know? Still, I'm glad I came back here. That's cool. We got a little magic rock. That's awesome. Talk to me, Professor. All right, back to... Let's go. <sighs> yeah, I'm burping. Excuse me. Excuse me. Let's be at least kind of polite. I know I'm an asshole. Let's not be like a, a complete asshole. I'll be a half... Half of an ass. Alright. You. Yes, let's go. Is there something in Japan? These are the questions. Uh, it does look like there's something there. But what is it? I mean, it looks like a castle. Alright. Stop over, yeah. Um... Oh, so we're gonna come back here later. Neo Tokyo. Wait, how am I... Oh! This looks... I thought this was elevated, but it's a road. We're not supposed to come here yet. You can tell because the houses are all modern and everything. Like trash cans, doors. Hmm. 
Mommy, why is that guy digging through the trash? Don't worry about it, honey. Just let him eat whatever he wants. <laughs> Got a magic rock. Awesome. Are we gonna break the game by getting like superior stuff? This is where you get the gun. Telephone. Wow, yeah. Little plant. Ark is just running into everything. There's TV. TV with a cat on it. Hey, office lady. To ask me on a date? But you're dressed so odd. I know, I'm, you're wearing sweatpants. Enix. Yos. Uh, I don't know what... Enix. You... Use? News? I don't know. I... My... My Japanese is... Really bad. And that's... One of those things, katakana, hiragana, whatever. Kind of looks like Dryad from uh, Secret of Mana. Is that what it's supposed to be? It's odd that there's a... Well, no, I guess not, because we have plants right there. All right. Okay. This is a big area. Street lights? No, I can't speak English very well. How do you know I speak English? Well, I guess I talk into him in English. Oh, hello. Nice to meet you. I have to go now. Thank you. Bye-bye. Ask me on a date. Did I... Why am I asking? Okay. What about you? Who are you? The antique shop owner is said to have a wild animal against the law. But no one has evidence. If you find anything out, call the police. Is she police? Okay. Let's go in here. I guess. You're the antique. I'll make it clear right now. I don't have a wild animal like a lion here. Okay. Odd of you to specifically say that, but I didn't ask. Um, not what I, not what I wanted to do, but, you know. Can I jump over that stuff? No. Can I talk to you? Do you, no, you can't speak English. Got it. Okay. Uh, we didn't, we didn't go in there, right? We didn't go in that one. I'm just running into everything. Um, okay. Antique shop. Creepy. This place is supposed to be one of those trendy <laughs> spots. Check it out. Is he peeping through the window? What does this say? Mo... Mochiko? I don't know. Oh, Cabaret. I see, he is a peeper. Well, hello, cutie, but you're a bit, you're a bit too young to come here. Come back when you're legal. That's a promise to keep, baby. All right. I see. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Okay. What a, we didn't go in here, right? Was this like subway or something? What is this? Shops? It's like an underground mall or something? Oh, we can go in. Pub. Right on. I had it. I quit this miserable job. If I could only say that. Yeah, salarymen. That sucks. There's only microwave food at home anyway. I'd rather eat here. Oh, hey, those pants you wear. They're called flares, right? I thought they were called sweatpants. 
Blonde hair and all, you're one hip guy. Thanks, dude. You, one of them, what do you call, street gangs? Um... I mean, it could be, I guess. Yo, welcome, what'll it be? It's ten gems an item. Grilled chicken, Japanese sake, no thanks. Hey, mister, no leading me on, okay? Wait, can we get sake? Let's see what happens. One grilled mm -hmm. chicken. Yeah, tasty. Thank you. Does it do anything? Probably not. This is the area where era where they did little things like um, Final Fantasy VI with the Phantom Train. Depending on who your lead party member was, you'd have a there was like a the dining car where you could refill your health because it was basically a dungeon. Um, depending on who your your lead character was, you'd get a different scene. And I I love that little thing. I love that stuff. It's like you know. Adds character, right? Japanese sake. Let's see what happens. One sake. Great. Thank you. Oishi. What's this? It says here, do not enter sewer under inspection. Right, so that's... Presumably, that's where you're supposed to go... Um when you actually are supposed to come here. Oh, dude. I need that. Welcome to the Speed Noodle Eating Contest. Got it. Hit A button and B button alternately to eat noodles. When you're ready, find an empty seat and face the table. Don't talk to me A too much. Noodles are coming out of my nose. Let's go for a million. Presumably he gives them to me if I... That's the prize for the Noodle King. I want to be the Noodle King. You can pack away more by eating standing up. That's the secret. Might be right. Oh, start. Um. Oh. How? What am I? What am I doing? Oh. Oh, it just doesn't show you eating them. How many am I supposed to- Oh, I just have to beat the Noodle King? Come on! Come on! Give me- Probably whoever gets to 31st. Damn it. Yeah, it is. Oh, Ark's the Noodle King. Hell yeah. Here's your prize. A beautiful stone. It's a rare item. Please do take it. I will take it. Thank you. I need it so I can shoot fire out of my fingers. Not out of my ass. <laughs> Which is what normally happens after I eat spicy food. I'm half joking. All right, next question. This says hotel. Is it a real hotel? Or is it a adult hotel? Welcome here, you're looking for a room. A single is 10 gems a night. Uh, no. We look forward to your return. Can I go into these? Got it, it's, you actually heal up. I mean, that makes sense. You can't just sleep in random people's beds. You know, the question though is, like, I assumed... I... I mean, I would assume... I would assume Lhasa is... Like, because I know you're supposed to advance technology, so I assume we're not supposed to go here yet until the technology... Until Ark does whatever and the technology advances. So this is probably like a... Like a, a workaround. I mean, I'm sure you can't do anything here anyway, except get those extra things. Too busy now. Oh. Too busy for what? Alright, well, before I go up the stairs, was there anything else? Right, okay, there was that.
This slot's been empty a long time. A fancy building would be nice. Or, I'm, I feel like we're gonna do something with that. Somebody help me, I'll never waste food again. Oh. You there, can you hear me? If you can, please help. Help, sure. What is this? What is this? Oh. Who wastes food? So we just gotta wait for a ghost to show up? Who doesn't clean up the room? I don't know. Who doesn't sleep at night? Oh, ouch. Is this a little kid? Like, what's going on? Oh, it's so wasteful. Dude, just stop spinning and let me whack you. <laughs> I'll haunt you later. Oh, dicks. <laughs> Do you bathe at all? Oh, that's right. I forgot we had a block button. Change your sheets sometimes. So wasteful. Ah. Where are you? Got him. Don't just eat junk food. Oh, go home sometimes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Same as before. All right. The miserly ghost faded away. It's a... Chicken? Thank you for helping me. I was held captive by that ghost. I was snoozing in the company crash pad like usual when... Jitters. Nobody could hear me yelling for help, but it's strange. I'm a game designer. I design games at Quintet. Oh. This is the developer. I know, I'll make a game with you as the hero. Sound good? Then I better get to work. When it comes out, please buy it. It's a little too late for that, I think, but okay. Fair enough. Quintet. Oh, and the lot has filled in. That's awesome. Wait, what is that? Oh dear, your poor mother will weep when she sees your hair dyed blonde. I mean... I've shaved. I'm happy. I have no religion. Don't pray for me. Okay. I, I, I guess... No! Go back in. Quintet. Interesting. Alright, so... Let's go in here first. Is this a fire station? Because it has the red light over the thing? Police. What's the matter, little boy? Get into trouble? Get into trouble with you. <laughs> what? Why do I wear shades inside? I have cute eyes that make me look nice. That's bad for my business. It's understandable. Keep that a secret. I will. Don't worry. I have cute eyes too. It's what I tell myself. In between crying sessions. Th this suspect is cowardly. He's pretending to be a penguin and refuses to talk. Well... Huh? I understand, little buddy. If only I could speak to animals, I could explain the situation, maybe. Alright, what is this building? News. You want a tour? Go up to the second floor. Okay. What time is it? Uh... Okay. I'm chasing a hot story about Dr. Baruga, the genius scientist of Mosk. What? Who's Baruga? This is a hot scoop, so I can't tell you. I wonder if it's supposed to be Beluga. Like the whale. But who knows. At Mosk, there are... Div Devoted followers of Baruga, the genius. They believe Baruga can give them eternal life. I wonder if Baruga is just the, uh... Like the reincarnation of, uh... Kamari. 
Ruga's supposed to be missing. Finding him is one of my jobs. Right. All of us involved in news media must convey the truth. That's how it used to be. To get closer to the truth, we gather, gather information around the clock. That's what it used to be. Now... Now it's owned by the corporations and they... Say or don't say whatever the corporations want them to say. Quintet, why is there a, sign, a picture of an unhappy guy in the name? By the way, that's a super old computer. That's like a Mac. Aha, sound. How do you like the music I composed? Let me know. I like it, actually. Oh my goodness, haven't been home for a week. My honey. Um, yeah, let's do the... We'll do the bottom doors first. And then we'll do the top. Dev department. Do you remember me? I finally made my debut as a woman programmer. I... I don't know who you are, I'm sorry. I'm programmer Penguin K, fake name. I'm almost human now. I try to be human at least seven days, five days a week. Make a two-day weekend. School teachers even have more holidays. Whew. All, all right. Very odd. General. Come on, you all. Two-day weekend starting next month. Work now. Okay. Hi, I'm S. Naka. As a rookie, I'm just a bit player, but I'll get big. Alright. Lab. Welcome to my lab. The beautiful resurrection scenes were made here. Oh, yeah, like the... CG. Sort of, the cutscenes. Yeah, that's really nice. But, it's lonely here alone. If you think you have it, please help me. Yeah, those, those were nice. I liked them. I like them. A single and lonely H. Moto-san's secret pet. It's Turtle. Is its name... What was the turtle? There's a couple turtles. One was the turtle from... Silver Case. Was it Red? President. Like the game Illusion of Gaia 2... Quintet has grown larger. Oh, so Quintet did Illusion of Gaia. That makes sense. Illusion of Gaia 2, I don't think ever happened. Unless this is supposed to be like Illusion of Gaia 2. It was worthwhile not shaving a while. I don't... I don't think... I mean... I'm sure it got cancelled, Illusion of Gaia 2. Like, I remember, I vaguely remember them talking about it, but... Graphic. But that's how it goes sometimes, you know, they're like, Oh, we're working on this game, and people are like, yay, and then they're just like, Ah, oh, we're not gonna, we're not gonna do it. Yeah, I bought another Mac. Macs are great. They're not that great. I need money. Aru, arf, arf, mom send rice. I'm going out for the dim sum lunch set again. I think I did dim sum. It's like individual... ...dishes. Planning. Thanks for last time. I started making that game starring you. The title is Illusion of Gaia 2. Pretty cool, huh? Oh, interesting. So this was supposed to be the sequel. This was supposed to be Illusion of Gaia 2. Cool. Oh. Because it never got released in the US, so they were probably going to do, like, Illusion of Gaia 2 to tie it in, but then they're like, ah, Terra Enigma, and we'll just release it in Europe or whatever. But that's, that's also what I don't get. Like, why localize it to English and only release it in Europe and not in America? That doesn't make a lot of sense.
Oh no, I clicked it again. Oh, we gotta stop. It's time. Uh, ish. Miyazaki-san laid a big lie that he was trapped by monsters. As the scenario writer, he should come up with better lies. It's true. But, I mean, he wasn't lying, but yeah. Better lies are good. Send your comments about this game to Enix Co. Limited. Thanks. Alright, that is... That is the whole of Neo Tokyo. So let us go... We have a few minutes left. Let's see if we can get back to... Yep. That's right. Let's see if we can get back to, um... Lhasa. Well, hey there, Jack. I just looked down, Jack's sitting there looking up at me. You just gotta wait a sec, okay? Just give me a minute. That's kind of cool. So there is a reward for you if you go back. And it doesn't break the game. It's not like there's any shops or anything, so that's good. Right, it's just a couple extra... Magi stones. Uh, and I really need to use those, but I just, I just don't. Hey, kitten. Oh, there he is. There's the fur. There's the, there's the little face. There's the face. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, Jack. You're so cute. You're so cute. Oh. No, oh, baby. I'm happy to see you too. Um, but I, I really can't see really. Um, he is like right in front of the monitor. There's the tail. There's the tail. Oh my gosh, you are such a baby. All right, how much time do we have? Not much. Okay, just, just sit there for a second, okay? Um, okay, so we have one zap ring. I would like to get another zap ring at least. Uh, we can do one. All right. Uh, we could do another geo ring. I'm fine with. I'm fine with not. Problem is, it's like. Wait, where am I going? This way. Yeah. I want to... Like, I want to use this stuff, but it's... It seems like bosses are really the only place to do it, and then, even then, you don't... I don't know, like, the last boss was more of a gimmick boss. Um, what about you? What do you have? Same fire ring, pyro... Oh, no, different, different stuff. Alright, let's run to... Lhasa. Yep. Okay, Tibet, um, we went... Did we go here? What happens? Oh, wait, what if we go... Well, we can't talk to animals anyway, right? So what if we go... We're probably not gonna be able to find the deer. I wonder if we should try that. I think I'd like to. I know that sounds weird, but I'd like to... Or the goat. Yeah. <sighs> Alright, so next time we'll... You know, actually proceed with the game. <laughs> We'll, uh, we'll probably try and go find the goat first, see if anything happened, if anything changed. Um, aside from that, that is all for today. Thank you guys so much for your time and attention. really do appreciate it. really hope you guys are enjoying these episodes. Jack is right here. I'm petting his face. Um, 
What is your guys' unique puzzle moment for today? For me, it's actually this... You can't... Uh, maybe you can see it a little bit. It's like a little... Uh, I don't know. There you go. It's kind of here-ish. It's a, it's a little back pillow. Um, it's like a lumbar support. Um, because I tend to hunch. Especially with my job. Uh, and so I'm trying to use this to... You know... Correct... Correct posture. Um, that would be the goal. And, uh... It must be working, because, like, I am relatively sore all the time. So... <laughs> so that's... Uh... But it's, it's good. It's in the pursuit of what I need. You know what I mean? So... Um, that's my unique positive moment. Oh, sorry, Jack. Hopefully your guys is just as good, if not better. Hopefully better, of course. And I hope to see you guys next time. Till then, guys. Take care.